Okay, I was going to do a quick video on my EDC that I carry into the woods with me every day. Like if I decide I want to go just on a short little scout out in the woods, um, just the minimal amount of stuff that I would consider to throw onto my body to carry out there, um, other than my walking stick that I've got the other video on. Um, just go over my quick EDC here. All right, this is just a lot of junk, but it all helps me out somehow. I have a little mini mag. Uh, probably going to replace this with a nano, but I like it because the battery is easy to replace. Little tweezers, you get these at Bass Pro. They hold stuff for you. Like a Instead of having a pair of tweezers, you got to pinch. You pinch these in, and they stay. So those come in handy. You get them in Bass Pro over in the fly tie area. Got this little pill bottle right here. Uh, you can get these from Walmart instead of having to order them. I think they're like two bucks, which are kind of expensive. But anyhow, they got some aspirin and leaves and stuff in them. Ibuprofen, uh, just general everyday pain relievers. We have uh, this one. I believe this one has some other medications in it. Got electrical tape wrapped around them. Endless uses for electrical tape. Mostly first aid. Those may come in real handy with uh, what you got in this bottle right here. Uh, these are cotton balls uh, soaked in Vaseline on the inside of this one. I had to order this one. This one's big. So. Anyway, you got you some cotton in there. You can take that, put it on a wound, use some electrical tape. Right here, there's some uh, fishing line wound up. Got handy. This one is my fishing kit. This one has hooks, sinkers, a um, couple of jigs. Uh, jigs are just easy to carry, so you got some bait in case you can't find any. Um, the little white tailed jigs are really, they really, really love those. Um, it's got an eyelet, one of them screw in eyelets in it, so you can make a fishing pole out of anything um, that I showed you. Let's see, I think I can get it out, it's actually on top. Yeah. Yeah. One of them right there, you can make a fishing pole out of anything with that. You screw it into the end of a stick when you got a fishing pole. That's my fishing kit. Um, this little crescent right here, um, I just picked it up. I found it. Um, it's actually a decent crescent. It's not a cheap one. Um, it's perfect size for just like tightening little bolts and stuff. And I find it comes in handy for holding bending stuff. If you need to bend like a tin can or something, you can just slip it over it, bend it. I mean, if you can't bend it with your fingers, but like if you have a, a found a can of uh, corn or something that was empty and you needed to make something out of it, you can use this along with your pliers. Just kind of like a little bonus to have on there. It's kind of probably stupid to have on there. Got a whistle. It's uh, pretty loud. Cheap. Just threw it on there. I think it was like 25 cents or something like that, so I threw it on there. I have a Brunton compass. This is a real true compass, glow in the dark, um, general direction only. Uh, you'd have to have, but I mean, if you know which general direction you walked in, if you take a quick look and know, okay, I'm walking this way, and just look at it every now and then, it's good to find your way back out. Um, clippers. Fingernail clippers. Uh, those are in there clipping line, you know, or uh, like fishing line, or if you need to like get rid of a hanging nail or something like that. It's got the little little file right there. I don't know what good it would be, but it has it. Just a little plus. Um, P38 wrapped in electrical tape so it don't flip out. You know, there's always uses for P38. Do that on there. Um, got an extra ring floating around. There. I got fire steel. This is not the big one. This was just an El Cheapo I think I picked up. 
It's not like it was, you know, $100 or nothing, $20. Anyway, uh, then I got this little Leatherman Micro. It's got a pair of tweezers on it also. It's got a little flathead, little bitty screwdriver with a bottle cap opener. Um, it's got a little blade. It's a pretty freaking little sharp blade because I don't use it for hardly anything because I have other blades on me. Uh, flathead and a file. And I believe it's the file that will strike this thing real good. Yeah. It's the file. Use the file for striking that. Just in this cotton balls, it fires right up. And then I always have a knife on me some sort and then I keep my Gerber usually on my side there's my Gerber diesel I'm a real big fan of Gerber I have a lot of Gerber stuff Gerber, Gerber, Gerber. this is only not Gerber but Gerber don't make a little bitty slim fitting micro like this so I like this one better and the Gerber has a real sharp blade on it it's got a file it's got a saw it's not, not really a saw it's a serrated edge but you could saw with it uh, it's got a real good file for you know sharpening stuff. But the the best part about these that I like better than anything, any other multi tool, is these are replaceable. Those are just little looks like lathe bits, and you can just replace those if you break them. Which that right there is makes those worthwhile to me. And last but not least, you've got your actual carry and the reason I choose this one instead of a different ring I know I can get bigger rings and whatnot but the reason I choose this one instead of a locking one is because it's smooth all the way around you can use it for protection if you needed to probably hurt your hand a little bit but you could but the biggest issue with it is take this set of long you know, rubber bands they fold up real nice and neat, throw them in your pocket. These are the heavy duty bands, and I have these little eyelets screwed in there. You can take these, slip them up over this. Now, with that loop that you have right there, you have an arrow rest. You can put your stick in there, a smooth stick, hold it, and fire it, and now it's like a sling bow. So you just one extra thing. These bands can also be used for, you know, shooting rocks or whatnot. Not out of this because you, you know, you don't want it to go through here and hit your hand. But if this was mainly for, you just put these over a stick, and make them a regular slingshot, or you can stick them on here. It'd be a bonus, and you got yourself an arrow slinger. All right, that's uh pretty much what I carry. Just that's just something I can throw on my belt loop and have everything I need for a little trek through the woods and uh, know that if I have this kit anything I run across as far as that I might need to get or gather or whatnot and I also have my blowgun that's for hunting you know um, my walking stick and it's gonna have one of these little things on it with another fishing kit and a few things in it and it's also gonna have my dart making materials and I can make darts out of what I got here um, other than that, I thank you. If uh, you want to see anything else, leave comments, send me a message.